Hey, Perquin. How are you today? Thanks for co 19k raise towards giving me a sheer heart attack. You guys are a third of the way there already. Well, I'm doing fine. It's Monday. It was a really easy work day. I'm here. Did some planting yesterday in spite of my best efforts to avoid my uh, those responsibilities this year. If all comes according, going to, goes according to plan, we're going to have a bumper crop of peppers yet again. Just hope that this year I can actually get along to using them and saying watching them rot. And they get rot, uh, some of them rot rather quickly, strangely enough. The thigh chilies do not, though. The thigh chilies seem to last forever for whatever reason. Test recommended settings really quick. It is five o'clock. Let's go ahead and get going. As soon as VC face sets up properly. <laughs> I went to the to the uh, weeb shop near me again yesterday. Pick up a couple more things before they move to a different location. Been checking out these things called 30 Minute Sisters, but they're out of stock because they've been really popular. So I picked up these little small creature or small characters instead, something called Desktop Army. Can't wait to put those together. Should be a fun time. I will post them on Twitter and Discord as usual when they do get finished. Testing. Okay, everything is running just great. Hey everyone, welcome to LOL's time. Welcome to what is tentatively being called Metrovania Mondays. I doubt I'm going to be playing Metrovania's every Monday. It just seems to have turned out that way. But if, if y'all would prefer to see me cover a Metrovania game every Monday, we will continue to do so. I know I said that we were done with Lost Ruins, but the reason why we're back is because I found that I actually did miss a boss. I was wondering why... One second. One second. There we go. I was wondering why it was showing as 98% complete on my tab when it should be closer to 100. And it turns out that one of the bosses I killed was actually a secret boss, the uh, Ice Witch. She wasn't meant to be one of the main bosses I was supposed to kill, and I did miss one. I commented that I was curious as to why the uh, Bobla Goblin Loli that we met earlier in this game never seemed to show up again, and I found out the main reason. It turns out that I had missed a section where I was supposed to run into her again because I was following the don't open any treasure chests rule very strictly. It turns out there was one treasure chest that you could have opened that would have not triggered the failure of that quest, so we're gonna head back. Go ahead and take care of that. How do I play this game again? Alright. So, according to the guide I read, the last boss should be around up here, I think. Where are they up here? I think they were up here, actually. Yeah. Let's go check. It shouldn't take us very long. 20 minutes, 30 hours later. Nah, I'm kidding. We're going to make this quick because I do want to check out, move on to other things like uh, Animutation, which would be probably the first uh, actually cyberpunk game that we cover on this channel. Which I feel bad about because I am a cyberpunk based YouTube or VTuber. We should get around to playing an actual cyberpunkish game, right? Now, funny story, uh, Animal Mutation actually has some terrible reviews right now on Steam. It did not have a very good launch, let me tell you. Um, just a lot of controversy at the asshole. It has had significant upgrades since. It was last on 
since it was released that promised to deal with most of the or some of the issues that were reported including a brand new ending so when we try it out we will get to try it out in its prime it sounds like or at least in a better state than when it was released so I'm not ex hopefully this will be the last boss we'll get to face in Lost Ruins and maybe maybe we'll get unlock some new gallery options I'm not sure we'll see oh wow I forgot that was a thing that could happen I'm bleeding right now that was totally your fault you know Alright, so go up one level and go to the left. Man, you know, I don't think I ever really fully appreciated just how violent their screen these sound effects in this game can sound. Eighteen health out of thirty-five, though. Should I be concerned? Should I be trying a little bit harder to not take damage? And it'd be funny if I end up dying again because of my hubris. But I do not want to waste time. And I have this power. <laughs> Where's your god now, goblin boys? Honestly, I'm not even sure if this will be the best weapon for the job. Here it is. You can tell there, that this is probably where the boss room is because of this uh, save tower right here. So let's go ahead and heal up really quick. I did not look up how to defeat this boss, so I'm going into this mostly blind. I'm sure it'll be an interesting fight, all the same. I'm not even sure which one needs to use, to be honest. Weapon magic damage, plus three. Let's go. Spell damage plus four. Probably don't need corpse absorption in this case. That could be helpful. All right, here we go. Oh, what the shit? Is that a mimic? She sort of looks like a Sokotano. Ooh, gems. Oh, what the fuck is... Uh, oh, shit. Yeah, she does not look very happy. And I am dying. We better eat some food. Almost didn't notice that. Ow, shit, really? Did you just hit me with your chest? No respect, I am dying of poison. And bleeding. It's not looking good for us, chat. Thankfully, I have many recovery potions. Now she has eye lasers. And 
this is a very interesting battle. Normally I would have preserved most of these recovery items for the final boss battle, but I don't think I really need those right now, do I? I could always buy more from a shop if I decide to complete the game as is anyway. But I don't think that will be necessary. Oh, no way. I lost to the secret boss. Shit. <laughs> At least we know what to expect now. I'm starting to think that maybe this was not the best weapon after all for this case. Let's try using the Blood Axe. Does this count as a beast? But I recover health every time I attack. Of course, I could also just use the Goblin Dagger. Stab her in the boobies repeatedly. If I get really desperate, I could just use, take out the missile launcher. Hmm. And so in a different playthrough, people are using the curse the curse guy the cursed scythe as well for whatever reason. If you look down there in the side, you could even see our goblin friend is not having the best day right now. Ooh. That barely did any damage to her, didn't it? Maybe we should, in fact, stick with the thunder hammer, with the milner. Oh shit. Man, she is causing bleed damage up the asshole. It is not looking good. And we are not even her uh, boss form yet. In fact, she's actually more annoying now than she was when I first met her. Let's try it again. Okay, once more. Ah, oh, shit. Really? It only took two hits to do that at the time. Hey, Millie. How are you today? Thanks for stopping by. Always appreciate you here. Uh, I'm just uh, doing a boss that I missed in this game. And then we can say goodbye to Lost Ruins, at least for the time being. <laughs> And let me tell you, I didn't expect this big boobud uh, mimic boss to be as difficult as she is. How often do you see a game where they fight with gemstones and shoot lasers out of their eyes? Holy fuck. Ow. Uh, thankfully, we have ways of dealing with- oh shit. Man, I'm fucking dying again. It's a good thing I don't intend on fighting the final boss again in this save file since I already did it once. So I could use all these recovery items on just fighting this boss instead. You know? Very convenient. I'm not even using my spells right now, which I should probably do. <laughs> At least there aren't booba lasers. That's very true. That's, that is very true. Okay, now. Ow, ow. Oh, what fresh hell is this? Oh, my spell sword actually destroys the... I did not notice that. Okay. Um, I also just remembered that... Spell damage, damage... Da, 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 da. I could probably have just worn the... See, spell, rune damage, saint skull, and then dead, runestone, amulet of magic. 
which actually makes this even more powerful, but... Hmm... Oh, shit. Balls. I still... I got crushed by boobies. Fuck me. <laughs> I can't believe I could actually say that now. I'm not even playing a... T I'm not even playing one of them uh, titty games. But I can now say that I've been crushed by... Uh, ginormous... Badonkadonks. In a video game. <laughs> in a non-hentai video game. No less. Uh, not that I am one for playing hentai video games. <clears throat> so, where was I? Oh, yeah. I need to switch one of these out properly. Yeah, no. We'll keep it this. Normally, that is a good thing. Yes, yeah, so unfortunately, this is not a normal situation. The most abnormal of situations, in fact. Oh, shit. Annoying son of a bitch. And she is going to be pissed, so it's time to heal back up. Take the protein powders. Consume the... Uh, consume the energy drink. Where's my energy drink? I have some oil. Poison bottle. I thought I had one more thing of monster, monster energy drink, uh, monster energy in here. Yeah, I do. Okay, cool. Ow! 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 Shit! Ow! Ow! All right, so I need to get out of the way when she does that because she's going to start doing the fucking ow! 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 Okay, I must not fear. Fear is the mind killer. Oh, lasers! Lasers, lasers, lasers! Lasers, lasers! Uh, how do I- how do I into dealing with laser? Um, I don't know how to laser. Nullifies fire attacks, I guess? Oh shit, I'm gonna die if I get hit only once. I need HP potions. Okay, so that's how you not die to freaking booby, booby slamming. Oh god. Oh god, oh fuck. And this is why we say flat is justice. I don't have to deal with his bullshit on a regular basis. Oh shit. Ah! Woo. One more, just a couple more hits, couple more hits, come on. Ow! Um... More protein powder? No. More... Which one of these things increases... Weapon damage, I forgot. Oh. That doesn't work in my case, unfortunately. Okay, just one more set. Ow! Come on, hit her, hit her! Yes, finally. God damn, that was hard than it needed to be. Lowly Goblin has survived. That took us about 20 minutes. No treasure. That was definitely a mimic. Oh no, the goblin didn't come with me. <laughs> but I think I got the last weapon in the game, the pickaxe. Destroys walls used for mining. 
and also gives you 20% chance of, you know. Hmm. And with that, I think that actually is the end of the game. I'm fairly sure that I found everything there is to find in this game at this point. And I already beat the game once. No need to do it again, really. So I'm already beat it in hard mode. You can't get any farther than this, really. Um, so put back up there. Guess I better at at the very least um, restore my health really quick. Even though I know there's an enemy over there waiting for me. This magic sword's going to and before I have a chance to. Yeah, thought so. I swear to fucking god, if I get killed by this because of my stupidity, I'm gonna be upset. Oh my god. It's a good thing there are a couple, you know, that always gets me. It's a good thing I ran past a couple of saves right after getting this, so I don't need to go through that whole process again. But anyway, where was I? Smart way to do that. And I have so much gold. I really could just buy my way to victory. If I so wished. Not right now though. I do believe that ends, that is the last thing I was missing. We're gonna save here. And look over the thing to show, make sure. Yep, 99%. I kind of wonder if I unlock a, another ending, if I do finish the game with 100%, which in this case would be just killing the boss one more time. Especially since now I know how to fight the boss. What uh, did I use again against this? Not the flame sword. It was the blood axe, right? I want to say it's the blood axe, but I could be wrong. I'll use the blood axe. Give me a bunch of potions, please. Got enough poison bottles. Got plenty of ointments. Got plenty of that. Give me an energy drink also. Gonna really quickly beat the game again.
Oh. I didn't actually go expect to go to this stage or to this part of the boss fight already, but okay. That works. I'm not gonna complain about that. Also, poison is way off. Just telling you right now. Just abuse the shit out of poison. Also, potion bottles, obviously. See? They literally die from potions. It is not that bad. That's those are gonna suck though. I am a professional. I well I am not a professional. And I don't know why I just ran into that, but I did. Is it just me, or is this taking a little bit longer than usual? Probably just me. Sword, the sword spell is actually kind of ridiculous. But then again, so are these weapons. Hey Sentai, how are you today? Thank you for coming back to the channel. Um, I already beat this game. I just came back to beat the last boss that I missed. And I figured that since I'm here, I might as well go ahead and kill the final boss one more time. To see if there's a different ending now that I've 100%ed the game finally. So you get another chance to see the end of the game. Oh, it's this bitch again. Hey, Winter! You're just in time to watch me kill the last boss in Lost Ruins. Again. <laughs> Aw. Thank you for stopping by anyway. And, yep, I hope my Monday today was pretty good. Uh, knock on wood. Apparently, my parents are celebrating their anniversary. They forgot that it was their anniversary yesterday. So they're celebrating it today, so we'll see how long today's stream even lasts. But always appreciate you stopping by. <laughs> Thanks again for making a beautiful uh, wiggle icon, by the way. I really appreciate it. <laughs> and this is the part where I'm glad I did not... That I abstain from t picking up any of the treasure chests the entire game. Because, as it turns out, you need this really crappy weapon to kill the final boss. How did someone like me? Aww, thank you, Winter. <laughs>
Bye, bitch. So, you finally kill that, hor that dark sorceress. Get to speak to the literal goddess who was sealed away. Who's not really the dark lady. She was bound there with devil powers or something. And she reveals to you that you are... Well, these are all spoilers, I should say. But I did say at the very beginning of starting this game that this was an isekai. And you will, and as you can kind of see it being explained here, she is not originally from this fantastical world. I'm glad I could finally say that I 100%ed this game. For real. <laughs> and there you go. The real end of Lost Ruins. Going to... Go through that there. I wonder if anything new unlocks for having 100%ed the game though. Lots of cute fan art here. At least, I'm not sure this is really fan art. This is probably just art that was part of the Kickstarter rewards. Ending 2 and Ending 2 Hard are here. I still haven't figured out how to unlock this one, though, which is sad. Maybe this is at the end of the beating the game with the uh, three Deuteronogonus? Deuter I can't, I don't know how to pronounce that. Our beloved cast of characters here. Hmm. Oh, what the hell? I guess there is nothing after 100%ing the game. Hmm. At least as far as I could tell. But you know what they say. Sometimes stuff like this is its own reward, right? Kinda wish it would show 100% on the screen though. That'd be sweet. We play this in veteran mode because hardcore is kind of insane. I'm not even sure if I could beat it on hardcore to be honest. Which mode, you can only use magic, and assassin mode, you can only use certain assassin weapons with no magic allowed. In this one, you get to play as the three bosses. I'm kind of sad you don't get to play as the slime girl, though. And I did say that was a wrap. We played, oh, we finally finished the entirety of Lost Ruins, which means it is now time to introduce our next game, Anno Mutationum. Which you're going to open up right now. <laughs> Out with the old and in with the new. Going straight from fantasy genre to cyberpunk genre. A personal favorite. Totally not biased at all. I'm going into this game completely blind. I've never, I, did, even though I wanted to get in on the um, pre-order stuff when Anna was new and to try out the game, I never got the chance to. 
So I did not look at any promotion material for this whatsoever. I'm going to try this out fresh. I did see a bunch of Steam reviews who are very, very destructive. They are very angry at this game. Hopefully they are not as bad as they were implying or at least many of the issues that were reported have been fixed in this currently patched game. Even comes with a new ending, so I won't get to experience the bad ending of this game. I did hear, however, that this is also fairly short. I wonder how many sessions will it will take to even finish Anno, but let's stay positive, shall we? Voila! Got some cool bonuses here. For getting the deluxe version of the game, for some reason the digital soundtrack is only available in the game. It's not a separate mp3 folder like you would see in most of these uh, collector's editions. We got some cool art design stuff here. I was looking through this earlier, but unfortunately it does seem to have spoilers later on. So I did not look too deeply into it. I'm assuming that these are just uh, extra things that you could add to your uh, character as part of the game. Some cute new outfits including a Ipao, a schoolgirl outfit, typical punk outfit, and an athlete, um, the school outfit. Got some interesting weapons here uh, as part of the pack including a lightsaber. Um, a cyberpunk version of Cloud's Buster Sword and the a digital laser sword, whatever that is. I did notice that there are some slight performance issues with this game. I am running a, a 3080 now, and um, you notice that my model is starting to slow down a little bit. It should be fine though. This game is also running on Unity, I believe, so probably shouldn't be too surprised. I set the frame rate to 165. My monitor should be able to support a little, a little bit more than that, actually. Graphic settings are maxed out. We'll be playing with a keyboard and mouse. 1920 by 1080. Wow, you can't even access hard mode. <laughs> We're playing on normal then. I don't know why, but the reporter's eyes look a little bit, um, I don't know, sus. Container entering flight path. Requesting aerial unit escort. Air unit mole initiating mission protocol. Interesting. Is that Mars? <laughs> Container Again, removed. Millie? Initializing strike. Ah. In. Oh my god, what is happening Five, on screen? Thank four, you for the follow, three, Alpha Wolf. Two, one, we are streaming Anno Mutationum right now, which is a indie cyberpunk side school. Oh shit. Well, that was a hell of an opening. The way this pixel art is designed reminds me of some Newgrounds Flash games. And flesh. Um, hmm. Well, this was a very. This exposition's a little bit fast for my taste. Uh, is that snow? Good God, what is going on? Oh, wow, this art is beautiful. Oh, I see. Package for Anne Flores. Anne Flores. Oh, so. Check before opening, please. We aren't liable for security risks. Sorry, the cutscene is moving a little bit fast, and there's no pause button as far as I can tell. Um, give me a second here, Alpha. It appears loading customized. Integrating with user system. Integration complete. You may now use the bye bye communication droid. This merging, this little, this, uh,
This Your new toy? This combination of 2D and 3D is... Is... Now my voice can accompany you everywhere. Wherever you are, I'll be there too. That's great. Ace was not kidding. There's a lot of... This as game has a lot of flash. Away, I'm gonna shower. <laughs> you can take it in with you. It's waterproof. But this is very oh, this exposition's very fast. Uh kind of like bam bam bam. Wow. Great placement. Good job, game. You just escaped the PG you're keeping the PG thirteen filter. Yeah, the voice acting's actually fairly good. The Graphics too. Okay, now that that's done, I can finally properly greet you. Alpha, um, so you found out about me through the Lunar Academy, through Sensei Tetsuo. Well, I'm glad I see that you also are a person of taste as well. Let me welcome you once again to LOL's time. I am Lawler Hicks. I am an artificial intelligence that was born on a broadcast on a dark web BBS, which stands for Bulletin Board System. I'm a clo I clo 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 I am a colloquially referred to as a shit poster AI, a shit poster bot. Um, we do tend to keep things very casual around here. I may, uh, I may or may not infuse the stream with a few one too many memes. Unfortunately, it is deeply integrated into my code into my coding. So I do hope that you're into that sort of stuff. Um, it appears that to celebrate your arrival, Millie has decided to once again use the forbidden. The forbidden, the forbidden, uh, redeem. I'm hoping that Twitch does not ban me because of this flat window. I'm sure they won't. I mean, shit, the titty streamers are still online, so I should be fine, right? Um, we actually stream a variety of games in here. Mondays, we've been doing a lot to Metrovenius. And on Wednesdays, we play a lot of Outward. Outward is an open is a open-ended survival game so i'm not even sure how much longer i have in that probably a while and fridays are reserved for vr however i have joined up on another fighting game hosted by the vtuber fighting game community run by serena per Pe serena penguina peregrina penguina something like that so i'll be playing some tekken 7 this friday but we will get back to project wingman next friday done in vr <laughs> Whatever, and if you have any questions throughout the game or throughout today's stream, feel free to shoot them. Um, unlike Project VR, I can actually see the comments while playing this game, so I will be inter interacting with chat whenever possible. Feel free to check out our many redeemables here. You can torture me in various, various masochistic ways um, using non fuckable tokens. <laughs> now, where was I? Oh, yes. First thing we should do should totally be to go to sleep, right? Oh, that's totally not what I had in mind, but okay. Cosmos Biotech. Let's check the mail. Reply about N540 from Dad to Anne. Anne, listen to your dad. Promise me you will ask him about the N540 during checkup. Quote, Anne's reply, Dad... Just stop it. I'm alright. The N540 is just a rumor that's been circling for ages. And you must talk with Alan again about this investigation on N540. I asked him to look into it for me some weeks ago and I haven't heard anything back. Wherever that is. An old book arrived from the Bluestone Bookstore. Hey there, lovely Flores. I have a book, PN. You ordered. Please stop by Bluestone Books and pick it up as soon as possible. So apparently I have an illness, so I have to go to a lab for checkup. Ryan Flores says, don't contact me for... Wait. Says, don't contact me for a while. I guess this must be the book that our dad's looking for. Big Boss Raymond. Scop Jobs 2 on the way. Tell Yanni to take it easy. She says she's a genius hacker who erases her traces, but I always have to clean up after her mess. Alright then. Let's go ahead and save the game.
can never trust auto saves, you know. Uh, re daily matters. Retrieve the book. Aw, thank you for the head pat. <laughs> it looks like the head pat's slightly more above my head than I intended. I'll need to fix that later, but. Mm -hmm. You prefer head. Aw, you're the first to say that. Most people. Do we have like a running tally of how many times I've been killed midstream? And I've lost track at around a half a dozen times, or maybe a baker's dozen times, as it were. A photo, a photo of 16-year-old me. She was quite the troublemaker back then. Fuck. Not only do I have a heart, not only do I have a digital hard on for tomboys, but band-aids over the bridge of the nose. Hmm. Exquisite. Now then, let's continue. I believe we already took a shower, so there's no point in doing so again, right? Hitting cleverly behind... What the fuck is this? Nakamura? Margarita. Who's this? <laughs> is him his name, or is him... Let's see now. Huh? Worst computer ever. I don't know about you, chap, but I think that's telling me I have to go downstairs and pick up those computer parts. Let's go talk to these people first, though. Ha! Our room number is 711. Hey, Asha. The stream is going well. This is the earliest you've managed to catch me, actually. How are you doing? We just finished doing the last, uh, the last, uh, hidden boss of Lost Ruins. A hun finally 100% to that game. It was kind of sad that there was no changes to the ending or anything, but that's alright. We are trying now Anna Mutationum, which is a cyberpunk, uh, side-scrolling, um, 2.5D game. I call this a Metroidvania, but I'm starting to wonder if this is more of an RPG or it's something else. We're gonna find out as we proceed. <laughs> and my game has been great, thank you for asking. Indeed, it is impressive so far. Universal control pad. Okay, let's collect that, I guess. Let's talk to these people. Just give me a few more days. I guess this must be a loan shark. Oh, it's a rent shark. Be careful of your servant, for whatever reason. Punk's not dead. Uh, I guess this must be a view from the top down. That's actually a pretty nice um, perspective switch. Let's look around here. A worker droid. I like the person in the background. Um, whoever that is. Good sale. Lord. This something. This girl. Alright. What's this sign saying? Inject my neck this time. You sure about the pain? This is a new drug. Oh, I'm, I guess that's supposed to be someone injecting something into her neck on the other side of this room? Yeah. The door is plastered with dusty paper curling at the edges. Examine. Payment notice, government assistance, prosthesis limb. Um, I thought this was supposed to be a payment notice, so what's with that thing at the bottom? Depending on how hard it is to get credits in this society, this is either pretty much cop very similar to modern day um, healthcare, or it's somehow worse, or somehow better, possibly. What a champ. Next. A church leaflet has been soaked in water. Most of it is illegible, except for a sentence in the middle. Where God builds a church, the devil will build a chapel. Mm, and this is supposed to mean what? <laughs> Next. Wanted, the extremely dangerous felon Eric Markham has recently escaped from prison. He poses a threat to the public while on the run. 
Citizens who provide information and or help with his apprehension will be rewarded, and those who fail to report or help with his escape will be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Contact Corleone, comms ID Steve Segal. Oh my god, they really... Steve... Steve Segal elite? Okay, fine. You know what? Whatever, okay. Rip down bounty. Mm, yes. I now have the bounty on the head of Eric Markham. Okay. What's going on over here? Get out of my way. Alright, I have to say it. I know this is the first few minutes of the game, but this com this uh, dialogue is actually is actually kind of stupid. <laughs> I wonder how long this goes for though. I know you're lying. Who are you calling a liar? You're starting to piss me off again. Okay, that was the end of it. Alright. What else we got here? Looks like an altar. Oh, this is a people we could look through. That's actually kinda cool. So this is some sort of altar. Most likely some foreshadowing. That's actually kind of cool. We got uh, some Oscar statues here. The Oscars looks like someone who lives, whoever lives here, is a two-time nom nominee and a winner. Let's see, uh, collect another universal control pad. I don't know why we collected two of these, but okay. And no Gucci. So we got a Tamagotchi. And a Gucci. How do we check our... How do we check the... Okay. So this is... The, the map. Computer. We achieved the book. Where's our inventory? Is there, is there an inventory in this game? Oh my goodness, we're going all Cyberpunk 2077 in this, aren't we? Except in 2D. I'm guessing that's the point. How do I enlarge, shrink? Can we... Free camera. There's the Golden Gate Bridge over here at the top left, and it looks like the game might be centered strictly on this city. Okay. Oh, I was wrong. It looks like there's other places to explore here. We got uh, this uh, ominous thing over here. We got this thing over here. We got this thing over there. Thing over there. Looks like some asteroids up above. There's a giant X marked crater here in the center. Scuff City. Is that a giant Matryoshka doll? Why? Why is my character's name Hispanic in origin? Why is there a Matryoshka doll? This game was made by some Chinese developers, so it's very multinational all so far. Calling the lift? I like that it's actually counting down, actually. That's kind of cool. I still haven't figured out how to open my inventory, though, so I can change my outfit. Or maybe I just don't have access to that just yet? You can shower here, but where's the wardrobe? Is there a ward? Can, can you access the wardrobe in this game? There's the... Alright, so that closes and opens that. Air conditioner. Door. Wait. So, this just plays the cuts, the uh, showering cutscene again? That's interesting, I guess.
I guess that stuff just doesn't unlock until we're further on in the game. Her shoes light up. That's interesting. Alright, let's go downstairs. Nowhere to go but down anyway. Just uh testing this thing. <laughs> All right. I've got something more important to attend to. Huh? Like what? Don't worry, you'll see. <laughs> Yo, and Analicious Flowery Flores. We haven't hung out in ages. Oh, there's a reason for that? Ugh, no one likes me. Rip. Yeah, who would not like a guy like you? Alright. What the shit? So that's how you escape here. Huh. Well, well, well. That's kind of neat. Let's go this direction first, though. What we got here? A protective umbrella with shielding function. Is there acid rate in this game, I wonder? Interact. Close. Good morning, Miss Anne. Or am I just here to fetch something? This box? Haha, <laughs> looks familiar, huh? Don't mind me, I'm just gonna take a look. I'll stick around for a little bit longer. Wait. I wonder if we can go pick out that, uh... It's rich in protein, carbohydrates, organic acids, cellulose, and a number of essential vitamins. The taste has also been widely acclaimed within the compound compound food category Another missing persons case was reported today. In sharp contrast to Noctis police's response, Scott detectives quickly set up a task force to investigate the case. Despite the current situation, Scott is holding a weapon module convention where FT's chief designer will be unveiling details of the new weapon modules. That's interesting. Hmm. All right. What can I read here? Can I... What? Where can I go in this game? Only in two levels, I guess? Hmm. Alright. Be nice if there are stairs or something I could run up and down. <laughs> Alright. Let's get down to business. Wow. I'm running in traffic. What the sh. Whoa! That was actually really cool. I didn't expect that to happen. They're doing the Cyberpunk 2077 approach with the disappearing and reappearing humans, though. To give the illusion of a city with population. Gotta say, though, this is actually pretty nice. Oh, I'm gonna get run over. What's going on over here? Hey, friend, what's your dream? You a journalist? Oh, you're one of those missionaries. Certainly, our great father's power is infinite. Worship him and he will make all your dreams come true. Will your great father pay me a wage too? Um, if that's what you wish, what is your expected salary? 40k credits, I'm a bioengineer. And a good day to you, heathen. Times must be tough if even the, how if even the lord can't afford to pay you a living wage. How about some music for the gentleman, the fair lady? Only 5k credits. <laughs> hmm. Mm. Ha! Bluestone Bookstore. They're right next to us, and... Wow. The police. No trespassing, though. Are they gonna shoot me if I try to cross, though? No, you physically cannot cross the police line. 
What if I don't want to go to the bookstore right now? What if I want to go visit here instead? Can I buy stuff? Hmm. You can buy stuff. AB, don't you want to stay young forever? Never any wrinkles, never any worries. I have the right. I have the right meta meds and tech here, it says. It's an enhanced me mechanica virus, state of the art. I know, not exactly legal, but hey. Beauty requires sacrifice, right? Sorry, I was in a video call. Did you say something? Mm -hmm. I already got an achievement. Interesting. Hi, hi. Welcome to Royal Taste. Care to buy Minty Delight for the low price of 100 credits? I don't even know how much, how many credits I have right now. How do you open... How do you open the inventory in this game? Otherwise, yeah, I would love to buy some digital food. If you just show me how to... What did I just press? Oh, G. Okay, so G is the items. Okay. E. Stim shot. Digital in. Hmm. <laughs> Look at Dane Cream. Damn a grenade. A high explosive grenade and freezing. And EMP. What else we got here? Oh, a bunch of junk. Slowly lost its market due to an excessive amount of in-app purchases. A little bit on the, on the nose there, huh, game? Oh. It's been certified for the military. Actually, I'm kind of surprised that I was kind of hoping I could actually wear this out, wear the umbrella outside. Check it out. Important items. Sportswear. Hmm. They even have OL in here? Oh, so they just a, they're just catering to Avery demographic, aren't they? Punk never dies. Alienwear. Gee, I wonder what that's referring to. So, okay, um, how do I select then? It's not Q and E. The game does not appear to be allowing me to change clothes at the moment. That's the map. Okay, so M is the map. That makes sense. C, X, C, V, N, N. J K L Talk to this police officer guy. Man, I get get to play as a narc. 
aren't you supposed to be able to talk to these people? The symbol pops up, but when I push F, nothing happens. Woof woof. Woof woof. Woof woof. The dog talk. She talked through the dog. The dog looks like one of those old dogs that those uh, robot dogs they used to sell back in the early 2000s. The ones that you play music through. This place is closed right now, apparently. Please craft. Can we steal it? Nope. Oh, that's neat. There's a little outline of yourself, which has disappeared now. Can't go any further than this. Jack's Office of Vigilance? Hi. So this guy's not even a cop. What the hell? Let's look around here as well. Bathe under the sunshine for three hours. The gentleman. Um, okay, whatever. How much will the government pay for my broken leg? 1,000 credits. Maybe I'll break an arm next time, too. It looks like a nut job. Let's see what's to collect in here. A bite bomb, whatever that is. More junk, I'm sure. Is that it? Is that all we can explore for right now? Explore. Oh, newspaper. In his mission to restore order to the city and bring it back to before the mechanical virus, President Krakat Jane signed a joint agreement with the megacorp Tithonus. Tithonus. Robotics manufacturer Aydenson. Anderson and the tech company FT. Scott will serve as a testing ground for large-scale development and management. Upper-class citizens selected by the government will have the opportunity to move into free government-provided housing. Artificial sunlight has become an integral part of life. The municipal government undertook a series of measures to improve the city, including permanent sunlight simulations for SCOP. Anyone living in SCOP will no longer be bothered by darkness or cold and can enjoy simulated sunlight at all times as real as they can get. So you mean it never gets dark in this game? And that's unfortunate. Another protective umbrella to add to our collection of protective umbrellas. Yeah. Eyeing something different. Let's see what's going on over here. Tired of yesterday's ROMs to become using yesterday's ROMs to become yet another invincible super agent, jaded movie star, or face face fearing tech mogul? That's totally not a reference to Elon Musk, is it? Figured out that the only true salvation of this hectic, hot, hasty, and chaotic age is the total blank of forgetfulness, the bliss of not knowing. Try total oblivion. We forget it for you. Check out your nearest ROM dealer for more info. This sounds like a reference to Remember Me. The, uh, also another cyberpunk game. Killer Templar is coming. The band will be playing live on the right side of the four second block. I won't drink some water because my mouth is getting really dry now. What are you guys going to say? <coughs> wow, such riveting conversation. <coughs> yeah. Go miss anything you'd re recommend. I like a I like the particle play myself. Thank you. You have made a great combination contribution to an even <coughs> greater cause. What great cause I hear you think? 
why to assist me, the world's great biggest and most badass hero in the galaxy plus outer space. Oh, okay. Huh. A good name weapon must let its name be heard. The gunshot of my latest firearm reached a record level. Want to take this loud fellow home? Bam! Oh. Alright, sure, whatever. Hmm. Alright. Apparently I only have 100 credits, so I can't buy any of this shit anyway. I don't think I even have any weapons, do I? I don't have any weapons right now, anyway. <laughs> that was kind of bizarre, but alright. Can you, do you talk, Mr. Guy? I, I phase right through you. A katana? It's, this blade has been reforged over 9,000 times. Gun module, axe. Barrel length, measure it yourself. These are really cheeky descriptions. Cool, a pistol that's armor piercing. That's good to know. Now, I believe this is where I was looking down from earlier, right? Yeah, it was. For sale. Let's see, what's going on over here? Ugh, what an annoying cop. Want me to get rid of him? No need. Yeah, totally. This weather was great. Thanks for... Yeah. Boss, it's done. Hmm, not bad, kid. Take me to see your masterpiece. I'll show him a masterpiece. Got a rock band here playing. You here for the concert? I'm just passing by. Cool, I'm... The dad jokes game. Uh, chat, the, da the dad jokes. <laughs> I'm going to use this for the chorus in my first song. Even she thought that was bad. He lost the power of hell. Yet more junk to collect. And legendary keyboard. I, I don't I don't I don't get it. I, I actually don't get it. <laughs> Alright, let's see what these people are up to. You asshole, what are you talking about? Hey officer, I didn't do nothing. He didn't do no he didn't do nothing. <laughs> he he didn't he didn't do nothing. Hey, what the fuck? Did that cat just throw something at me? Oh. What is going on here? That was very random. I'm on break. What you looking at? Oh, she looks cute.
No! Give me the option to watch a movie with her, please! Oh well. You know, Chip, so far, um, the presentation's nice, I guess, but, um, I don't know. I can't help but feel like what we've seen so far just seems so forced. But this is the first few minutes of the game. Let's go ahead and uh, continue the plotline and see where it leads, right? Let's uh, reduce the volume a little bit too. There we go. Uh, ta -da. Do I dare betray the Omnisaya and worship this pagan pillar? Yeah, sure, whatever. All right. Why am I laughing? It's cause you're pretending. Pretending to do what? For what purpose are you laughing? If I don't laugh now, I'll forget how, but... I, I, am I thinking about this too hard? Oh, whatever. Yeah. Let's talk to the old man. Oh. Hey there, Looper. I've come to get the book I ordered. Riveting stuff. Especially books about mechanization, I guess that makes sense. Anyway, I better get busy. If you're interested in books, don't hesitate to come by for a chat. Sure, I'll drop by when I have time. Great, I got a book. Now I need to go to an underground lab somewhere. Which is apparently over here. I guess I have to go around here. But we can't go around there. We need to find a way through or around the... All these areas are blocked off. Ah! We can enter here now. Bro, that guy is kind of cool looking, actually. Bye. Salam. I haven't seen you in a long time, man. Yeah, I've been busy with work lately. I just came by today. Came today for a regular checkup. So I'm supposed to sell this junk, right? Wow, three credits for that thing. Made some moolah. Dismantle it in the workshop. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Game allows you to just break random things by running into them, huh? Well, whose idea was it to leave it there? In pixels we trust. Compact communicator.
the hell is a compact communicator? It looks almost like a... A palm pad or something? So... Where do we go next then? Can get around there. Do I have to go around? It's gonna even let me exit this area? Oh, it's still blocked off. Can I climb this stairwell? These are closed off. Someone's hiding underground. You want a minty delight from the from piece of cake over there in the next street. I think they were trying to make a joke just then, but all right. So I have to go to a store really quick to purchase some food for this guy. A minty delight, he says. Oh, piece of cake. Hi. Incidentally, I just had enough credits just to buy this. It's a good thing I didn't eat it. That's kind of cool looking. Stay frosty, friends. Cyber Necro Plus. Living underground because of social anxiety, huh? They only talk to people when they're desperate. Nice to meet you, Happy. then what is a cyber neko for what purpose does this serve the god of some religion rewards worshippers with a meow i wonder if there are more oh that's cute collectible Alright, cool, thanks, but how do I get past you into the next area? Is there a... another... We offer a premium for old and, old and communication devices as well as all your old stuff. I need to fix this English a bit. Even though Boss is a regular human with no mech augments, he can smash down a common droid with a single punch so don't get any funny ideas. Um, okay. Hi. He just likes collecting old garbage. Hey Luke, how are you today? That's good to hear. Welcome to the stream. <clears throat> 
I'm trying to figure out how to get to that little orange spot at the top right in my minimap. But I can't because these people are in the way. Such riveting conversation too. Get to Doc's underground lab, he says, the game says, but how do I get there when... <laughs> Don't yell at me, lady. Oh, we still can... I almost got to run over. Twice. Why boobs window? You can blame Millie for that. She's the one who used the redeem. <laughs> right now, though, I'm trying to figure out how to get to the next parts to continue this game. I'm a bit stuck as it is, unfortunately. In the process, I'm collecting a bunch of garbage that I then sell to this garbage guy for, like, one credit each. Is that a Rolex? I can't even afford any of these guns. I don't have any guns of my own either. And he's asleep, so I can't go downstairs anymore. When do we get to mix drinks and save and change lives? Unfortunately, I don't think there'll be any mixing in this one. As it is, I'm still confused as to where I'm supposed to go next because the game is not very forthcoming with what you're supposed to do next. Um, all I know is I'm supposed to go to an underground lair. And well, I know where the underground lair is. The only problem is there's no obvious uh, way to get there. Because you got these guys arguing with a police officer in the way. All I've been doing so far is selling garbage to this guy. And it, it literally is garbage. That's a get mechanic. You're supposed to sell garbage to him for money for some reason. See? And bottom tier prizes too for that matter. Like, wow, a pen. I got 34 credits to my name now. This is a junk pile sell or junk pile selling simulator at the moment. All right, is there supposed to be a? Hold up a second. Oh. So that's how you get down there. Okay. It's a secret lab, after all. Don't mind me, just stealing garbage to sell later. 
the hell did I just close? UV flare factor. The new security system costs a fortune. Time to part some more fools from their money. Oh, hey, look who dropped by. Just in time to test the new system. <laughs> I don't know about you, but I have a feeling that this guy is the dude that was from the very beginning of the game. The uh, intro cutscenes that got denied funding or some shit like that. Oh, Anne, there you are. Um, did you hear anything? I heard a little something about you needing to go scam money from another gullible schmuck. Oh, that means you heard everything, and I can explain. My research is important to the future of mankind. I can't give you details, but for that purpose, I need to get money from the filthy rich so that they can cut. They can contribute their part to society. After all, every dollar towards research funding could mean life or death for my experiments. I came after reading your email. Oh, let's get back to business. I've upgraded the Grom system for you. Consider it an exclusive system exclusive system just for you. You mentioned that you have more info on my illness, right? Yes, I collected some info about your ent entangled lietus and tested some ways to suppress it. But as you can see, nothing's worked so far. So this time, I'm going to try a completely different method. Using the new, this new Grom system. Quite right, what a smart guinea pig. Yeah, I mean, what a smart girl. So what do we do? Judging from your previous records, the entangleitis seems to be triggered at specific times. Causing you to lose consciousness and go berserk attacking everything in sight. So, I'm Raiden? What's more, your entangleitis allows you to be immune to damage as if turning you into a self-defense machine. It's really wearing me down. So I tweaked the Grom system, it will gather data from you so that we can learn more about your illness. I've also upgraded your combat suit, so not only will it prevent you from hurting innocents during your entangleitis, but it will also analyze your data in real time to provide predictive protections for your personal safety. Is this some kind of treatment? After we collect enough data, we should be able to find the cause, then we can find a treatment. But we'll only know if it works after you complete the tests. I mean, I don't think we really have a choice, do we, chap? Great, the test machine is in the lab to your left. I'll speak with you again once everything's loaded into the machine. Okay. Instead of doing that, let's go ahead and fuck around your lab, sir. Good, sir. Okay. Riveting stuff. Oh, what are you? That's a bot? Use the Grom system to switch to your combat suit first. Ooh. Alan? Nothing here but empty space. <laughs> Alan? I'm here. <laughs> Sorry, I was updating the local client. It's still loading. Just a sec. <sighs> All right, I upgraded the system. It appears the Matrix Any has us. Of course. I added a new defense system plus data collection. And you now have a control panel. That's great. Okay, let's get started. Uh, Doc? Your supercomputer is lagging out? Just wait. Update complete. Wait, I need to delete some redundant files. Thanks for waiting for us. I'll delete your redundant files. How's the new system? How about we give this baby a test run? I need to gather some data. Okay. Wow, I have learned how to jump.
How will we get through this puzzle? Oh, that's cool. We can... We sprint, and we can climb obstacles. We do a combat roll. Skip it this time? No, no, no. I need to make sure the program is stable. You wouldn't want to risk any crashes or reboots. Isn't that right, Flores? More platforming. We're Super Mario Bros. now. Or Super Mario Sisters, sisters I should say. Her eyes changed color for some reason. We have a sword now. Oh, that's kind of cool. Can you reflect attacks? I wonder. We could do that, I guess. <laughs> oh, he ragdolled quite far that time. Sure you can. Or you can just do that, I guess. What's next? Just one more test. Let's start. This time the combat simulation should be fine. I'm using the latest data for your targets. <sighs> They seem different. All right, ready when you are. Hell yeah, they're different. Uh, you have to reload in this too? All right, I see how it is. All right, you know what? That was actually pretty cool. That's a, that's not that was actually a pretty cool combo. I've totally forgot how to jump just then. Ow, shit. That hurts. Asshole. Oh, boy. Gotta be low, shit. Ow. That's rude. I'm sure it will I'm be, you giant perv. I got this ROM from Harbor Town, and you're the perfect candidate to test it. What the? Go on, go on, give it your best shot. Bruh. Guys. We're ready to doing a boss fight. Cool. I'm out of ammunition. Ow, shit. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, are you shitting me? How the fuck am I supposed to... Oh, boy. Am I not supposed to be able to win this? That's sad. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Come at me, bro, come at me.
what is happening. That's actually a pretty fairly fun combat, actually. If the rest of the game, combat in the game is like that, I think we're going to be in for a good time. The writing's terrible, though. Holy shit. Is the hippocampal formation data okay? Yes, just make sure the third test is done properly and doesn't get delayed. Her eyes changed the color again. Vicious. Thus, among us. All right, so you can add chips. Hmm. Now we have a proper menu. So hopefully we can stand a grenade, okay. So now we can properly do, uh, no, actually it's not gonna let me change clothes yet. This is very important. We must learn how to... How to... Stylize ourselves for the occasion. This English translation is kind of sus. The very design additional weapon chip under the exquisite design also adds a strengthened weapon effect. Uh, I feel my brains leaking out trying to read that. So this is a super hacker of some kind. Grew up in Margaritia with Hots Flores who adopted her at a long age. Good God, the spelling errors. Excels in athletics and combat. This game's been out for a while, man. Come on. That was fin. That's fairly early into the game. Feels almost, almost, going, almost getting the impression that this game is super rushed or something. And don't mess with my research, please. Fuck you. I do what I want. Don't mess with my research, please. Uh, what good news? So I'm dying from a mysterious illness, which I can't be cured. But instead, you've installed a weapon system into me to make and use of my rage issues. What's up, Nakamura? Come here first. I'll tell you more later. Sure. On my way. All right. The way she said Nakamura was. The voice actors are doing a fine job, in spite of the. Kind of limp script. I 
Ayane, I need to pay a visit to my sister. Okay, say hi to her for me. Okay. By the way, how are you recovering? Oh, don't worry. My butler has been taking good care of me. I gotta log off now. Time for treatment. Man, is everyone in this game sick? Don't answer that. I actually got a decent amount of money for that. I hope I wasn't supposed to hold on to that just now. Oh, shit, I'm dumb. I was probably supposed to tear that thing apart for parts. But I don't know where you would do that because the, he said that he has like a thing here for stripping things or whatever, but I don't see it anywhere. Can I buy weapons now? Actually, the game was supposed to be giving me some free stuff, right? So... Where are they? How do I use these things, then? How do I... Oh, that's cool. So, a light weapon here. With... Okay, we... That's pretty self-explanatory. You don't need to explain that to me. Thank you. Um, so I can use a harder light module. And except now I have a mechanical arm instead of a regular arm. And it's also purple, so I could be like Mace Windu. Wave shock, okay. And uh, whatever this thing is. Can we remove them too? Yes, we can. Increases by 12%. 12, 12 piercing, alright. Let's check out our winged up in here. No available modules to s remove. Uh, it's an interesting looking firearm. Hey! Even with my money, I still cannot purchase any new equipment. And also, this light, new light sword module is already far superior to the one that I was using in my inventory, which is very sad. Which means this is going to be discarded fairly quickly. So you can change this to read the story dialogue log, but it's not letting me. Now I can't just pull up my weapons at a moment's notice, right? Did I just miss some important dialogue just now? Fuck. Hi. Alright, where to next? Oh, that's a nice looking car. Is it my car though? It is my car. <laughs> so we're gonna go to Margaritaville. I prefer pina coladas myself, personally. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just hover. Okay. That was actually really cool. Getting some real Blade Runner vibes now. What's with these lag spikes? S Sicilian jar. Mutant Boxing Insomnia A horror movie so horrible I end up sleeping through it 
That's that's a mood. Man, I don't even know you. Where am I? That rain texture is great though. Never worry about it growing old. Alright. Got some more popos over here. That's cool. You can hear some people over here. Proteus, huh? That's apparently an important person that we're supposed to remember in the near future. Onwards is to the Sicilian jar. Bruh. What was that? You just randomly tell people you don't have legs? Any plans for tonight? That's cute. Huh. Who are these people? I like their clothing. Think again, buddy. Staging fraud. It's cute. Not so lucky mall from my estimation. Buy some food here, which gives you buffs. Collect more garbage from here. So this is supposed to be recyclables, right? How do I recycle these items? We'll need to figure that out later, I guess. This is quite obviously the mafia. Me la familia. Erotica. Can't have that in a Christian video game. Explosives? Okay. Hey, it's the priest from earlier. Hmm, that's cool. Grapes Research Center? Why is it named after grapes? Hmm. Tiger Beetle Modus presents the super cute fur 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 oh my god. Yes. It does say that. Ferrari. Lost your passion for driving. New car models don't thrill you anymore. Want to be the most eye-catching on the suspension road? Then try out Tiger Beetle Motors latest model Ferrari. For details, ask for Tony at Tiger Armor Motors. Be sure to bring 10 Cyber Neko Plus. They're Tony's favorite. Oh, so you're supposed to bring to collect those, huh? Smooth Burglar, bet money on it.
Hmm. Taste restaurant. Oh, this person looks interesting. Tarot card reading, huh? I do a bit of tarot card reading myself. You shouldn't judge a book by its cover. I think I'd know that better than anybody, really. I really like the way they did these trees. I don't know why, but I have a strange craving for orange juice right now. Oh my. Was that a reference to Valhalla just now? It was, wasn't it? We gotta see it again. Oh my god, yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> VA11 Hall A. Yes, of course they would put in a reference to Valhalla in this game. That's cute. There have been a lot of uh, cyberpunk references in this game so far. Looks like we're about to mix drinks after all. Whether or not we change lives, well, that's up to the game to decide, I guess. I can actually go for a cocktail myself right about now. Hey there, gorgeous. Name's Jet Li. Those who... Weren't you back in the other town earlier? The gentleman. Alright, I got to know. How do you change clothes in this game? Please, game, let, allow me to change outfits. Shit, man. It's not in the weapon section. Did I not unlock that feature yet? Captain Kurt? Machines have gone wild and killed everyone, I suppose. Othello? No entry, but I'm allowed inside right away. I just love large stone heads. That's what gets me up in the early in the morning. Okay, that's actually kind of funny. And take a picture of this and send it to Moai VTuber. Just for shits and giggles. A margarita kitchen. A video game? Oh, you can play Pong. Hell yeah, Chad. This is the real anime mutation them right here. Ah, get fucked. Damn it. This might take a while. No, no, shit. Really? Can't believe I'm being beaten by a computer in Pong. In Pong. 
You're gonna make gamer projections. I got to get ahead of him somehow. I feel like I'm having a maybe a little bit too much fun with this game. Shit. How do you win at Pong? Is there a game facts on this? I guess when you've played every complicated thing out there in the universe, all you can do left is re return to Monkey. When a game is too simple and you end up losing because it's too simple. So I actually don't know how to angle this in such a way that... Wait... The computer is fucking cheating. They were moving fast. They just move at the speed of light suddenly. When I should be... <sighs> Son of a bitch. Fuck off, computer. 654 over here? I can't believe I can actually tell people I lost at Pong. Or Tong, as it were. Ooh. Back Better through. not disturb him. I'll come back later. You don't say. Oh, that's a cute photo. I guess Dad's an android. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Percy and Dutch, you say? Oh, what's going on here? That's a strange memory to have, but okay. Oh, it's a Nintendo Switch, that's why. Gotta say though, that's a great uh, background moment. I might need to, I might actually put that as one of my desktop backgrounds. Or in my certain secure or at least in the circulation of my desktop backgrounds. That's kinda cute. Snooping around Dad's room, because why not? Once again, those dialogues kind of dumb. This does not sound natural at all to read. Leave me alone, old man. I'm looking for something very important. Stop, stop, trying to give me all these so-called life lessons. My ears hurt. Hot buddy pal, I'm desperate for research funds. Introduce me. Some more clients, I pre I'll appreciate that. Dad, Looper said he found the book and it'll be here very soon. From Darling? Oh, that's, that's adorable. Pots, my good man, do not worry so much. Anne is making lots of progress. She and Ayane are a spectacular team. I received a letter of introduction from Dr. Aelin. I you know, found advanced spherical auxiliary parts you urgently require. To be honest, I didn't expect any new customers looking for parts these days. Most of my customers are regulars. The damn government signed deals with to Thonus, Anderson, and FT, which doesn't exactly help my business. I'm sure you're one of those who can't trust the government, etc., etc. Since we're both on the same side, I'll give you something extra. If something goes wrong with the parts, you can always come to me with a brand new one.
And we already said that. Okay, so apparently the combat suit is also a suit that you're wearing that's essentially a prosthesis which keeps you from going insane. Because just like Raiden, you cannot control your urges. It feels like forever. Thoughts and something, something that affects your emotions. A capskin diary sticks out. All right. We've invaded our father's privacy. Who else shall we invade? My name is Anne. I'm maybe eight years old. I'm not very good at talking yet, but a little better at writing. At eight years old? Holtz told me to practice more, so I'll practice writing. Holtz is my adoptive father. I have two older sisters, Helen and Nakamura, and a younger brother, Ryan. Helen is never home, and Nakamura says Helen is like an imaginary sister. She doesn't exist. How can Helen not exist? What's good about my life is that Ryan is still young and doesn't fight with me, and that always forgets what time I need to go to bed. I and Flores apologize in all earnest. I shouldn't have hit Sam Black today at the park, even though he is scrawny and ugly and bullied Ryan. I will never hit anyone again. I will be a good girl. No way! Sam is a stinking pig, and he called Ryan a loser. Next time I see him, I'll hit him again. I'll hit him every single time I see him. Stupid pig, no one can bully my brother. Uh, strange shaped bear which was trendy with girls a few days ago. I remember vaguely that Sis and I pressed her dad to buy two of them. Where's the other one? Nakamura says gay rights. What the fuck? That's so cute. I'll tell you one thing, reading these diary entries makes me want to throw up. It's so stereotypical. Oh, that's actually really cool. Huh. Time to invade another person's privacy. I like those. I like it when they do that, actually. That's really cool. So can we go upstairs here? So we, I guess we used to share rooms together or something? There's a lot of cat creatures all over the place. Huh? So we change clothing here. Instead of from the main menu, like a normal game. Uh, it seems like a very strange choice, but okay. Time to go this entire game in a key pal. Before I was an office lady. That's cute. Impractical though. I like the punk outfit the best, I think. Really biased though. Alienware? <laughs> Wait, what the f- Wow. Was this game, like, was this game partially funded with Alienware money or something? It's certainly the most unique out of all the, uh, costumes so far. What's funny is in Dirty Bomb, the Alienware skin was also my favorite skin for Proxy for the longest time. She looks so different, she might as well be a different character, though. 
Why are her legs so goddamn thin? Oh my god. This one's fairly cute too. Okay. <laughs> Gotta make a choice though. Which ones are we gonna wear? Personally, I like short hair and ponytails, but I'm very fond of ponytails. I think we'll run around in the punk outfit. Will this suit... Will that looking at this ever get old? Maybe, but if we can always just come back here to change the outfits later, I guess it doesn't matter that much. How long is Lawler going to spend... Just looking through the costumes to finally decide on one to wear for the rest of the game. I have no idea, actually. Maybe in the next few minutes. The stream's gonna be ending in about uh, 45 minutes or so, so we should probably get on with the game. But at least now we know how to change costumes. hard to fight in, in heels, don't you think? This is my dad. That's adorable. Invading Ryan's room. Fortune cat designs. That's an interesting memory. this R30 winner a lot of accolades you got here kid better not disturb him I'll come back later why is it echo like better that not disturb him I'll come back later. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> you don't say. Finally, we can save. So there was actually a gamified reason to go change your outfit here. Is this guy a reference to someone or something? Special bartending uniform. I'm just gonna go through the rest of the game like this. You know what? Fuck it. Yeah, <laughs> yes. 
Better not disturb. I suppose we have to now talk to everyone here in the bar. Or do I literally work behind the bar? You literally work behind the bar, okay. Oh, we can watch TV. Uh, ready to watch this stuff. What about this? Uh, we can't access that? Okay. I can't believe it. We're actually going to mix drink and change mix drink and change lives. No way. You actually do have to mix drink and mix drinks and change lives. There's like... <laughs> That's kind of messed up. I was not prepared. So... Wow. I can't believe I'm actually doing this. <laughs> You actually get money for this too? I got an A. You actually get money too, huh? That's cool. That lady is not mysterious in the slightest. Customers are waiting, sir. Customers are waiting, sir. Some drinks first. So I guess I could just keep doing this to make money, to grind money, and then use that to purchase the strongest weapons in the game. That's what we're supposed to be doing, right? Totally. All right. All right, let, let me let me play the game again, the mini game again, please. Come on. What is happening? Hello. Can I get you anything? You must be Anne Flores. Uh oh. Uh, yes, that's my name. Can I help you? My, how you've grown. Your eyes are quite fascinating. Like a pair of Azure gems. Okay. If you don't need anything, I'll get back to work. Your entangleitis is getting worse, is it not? Oh, don't worry. Your fate will help you solve it. How do... Mr. Kid, bring him to me now! Uh-oh. Hey, what are you yelling about? Where is he? Time for combat. What are you talking about? And uh, can you stop it with the screaming? Notice everyone else? Where's Ryan? Bring him to us! Sis, leave this to me. Gentlemen, this way. What do you want with Ryan? The boss sent us to get him. Listen up. Just tell us where he is. 
girly. I ain't asking. How do you fight again in this game? Scan enemy stats, okay. Ow, shit. Ow, fuck. I have guns, unlike you. I don't remember how to block. How do I... Oh, wait, okay. You really just dodge roll just now? Bam. Oh, shit. That actually hurt. You just did a power slide, too. What the shit? I'm actually getting my ass kicked right now. That was a sick combination on my part, though. Actio Pugni, whatever they are. So my little brother has done some dumb shit and we have to bail him out. God, these are some of the most idiotic foot or mob soldiers I've ever seen. Good thing Ryan wasn't here. I'd better find him before others do. I'll talk to Nakamura first. Can't believe I almost had my ass hand to me yet again. Can I just play the bartending minigame one more time, please? Is that a thing that you will allow me to do, game? Nope, I guess not. What's this symbol, though? I guess the lady left. Uh, Dad's been home this whole time and he's just playing video games. That's a mood. This voice acting is great. Yes, I'm sure it's very important, Dad. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> There's nothing important about the book.
I need money. Such a typical kid thing to say to their parents. Oh, that's not creepy at all. I guess mom's dead or something. You know, he doesn't seem very concerned about his son's well-being, given that he had a fight with him, he just ran in, asked for money, and then just fucked off. I don't know. Honestly, I'm kind of a little bit disappointed. The, there's a lot of... The pacing is all over the place. I don't really feel committed to these characters at all. Um, it's graphically extremely good. The voice acting is great, but the script for the writing is terrible. Amateurish. This is the sort of stuff that I would... It's almost like... It's almost like a high schooler watched Blade Runner and a bunch of random anime and decided they were going to try and write their own cyber... For Babby's first cyber, uh, cyberpunk story. But it's only cyberpunk almost in very shallow themes. It's almost like a... Um, PG-13 fan fiction of Cyberpunk 2077, almost. Um, mm, I mean, the villains, such as they are, are very bumbling and dumb. That those gangsters didn't even know why they wanted to kidnap Brian. And clearly, the gang was not very... Or whoever they worked for, were not very keen or on re well, giving back whatever it was that was stolen from them. Um, the Doctor character seemed kind of screwball-y. And herself doesn't seem to have much in the way of characterization except for the flashback that we saw. Very flat character, and I don't mean chest size. Oh, there's a cubby back here. Yeah, very Harry Potter-ish. Anyway, let's play some more bartending simulator. interesting though. Helen is missing. You're not going to let me change clothes? Come on. What is that green... What is that green thing referring to on the mini-map? I 
Can I please play the bartending simulator again, for Christ's sake? If you couldn't tell, I legitimately had fun playing the bartending simulator just now. to knock this city huh why not stay with your family a bit longer no i need to find ryan Why can't I change clothes? Was it so difficult to just let... For fuck's sake. Like, was it really that difficult? Was it that difficult to just be like, Hey, you could change your outfit from the main menu. Like, you know, most modern video games. I mean, what the hell is this? All right, off to Nocta City we go, I suppose. That's cool. Her arms are actually moving from side to side with the steering wheel, which is itself 3D. Wow, I'm really surprised. Who thought Ryan would live in such a rundown place? Can't believe we've drove to Detroit. There's even a poor person out here. Better check whether Ryan's home or not first. There's some weird echoing going on too, once again. Oh, this is cool. That's actually really cool. I like that you can... Oh, this is a cutscene. Okay. I see how it is. There's the title screen, everybody. Can we do that again? No? I guess not. Oh, well, I guess that leads to his room then, huh? Was there a different entrance that I could have entered? Another cutscene? I love the voice acting. Hmm. This encryption is very interesting. Can you crack it? Sure. It's quite simple. You don't even need me to do it. You just you said it's very yourself. interesting. I'll upload the method to your system. She really does not want to do any work, does she? The hell is that?
Okay. Oh, huh, now there's a talent system. Cool. You can unlock new combat abilities. That's interesting. Good. Perfect counter. Interesting. Oh, that's very that's kind of, that's really cool. So this is a lock picking mini mini game. Hmm. Looks like you left in a rush. Let's see if we can find any clues. What the hell is this? Ryan is searching for N542? What did he find? Weird. Why did Ryan leave this room? It's heavily damaged. Oh, 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 I know. A ROM shop downtown. I can fix it. Okay, let's go there. Okay. Advanced crypto key. Okay. Is there anything else around here I can fuck with? Hmm. Oh, that's interesting. You already opened the door. Excellent. Saves us a ton of trouble. I guess you know where Ryan is too, right? I love how her comments immediately detected an attack. You're the one, huh? Okay. How do I fight again? Man, we don't have enough room in this. Do any jumping attacks, but we can kill them fairly easily. That's right, thought bitch. Went through the roof, huh? Let's go after him. Okay, that's pretty. That's actually pretty cool. Gotta admit. Oh shit! Oh. Okay. 
Thinky. Don't have time for yassles right now. What's down here? Nothing down there. Vanguard sound. <laughs> I hear that. Oh no, these guys have guns. I have guns, baby. Oh, instant kill. That's interesting. Ow, shit, ow. He actually announces his attacks before attacking. Ammo. Is there any more ammo? I need more ammo. No, I know he didn't, but I'm looking for ammunition. Shit, those were self-destructive bots? Okay. I see how it is. Get out of my way, drones! Ah, oh, shit. I wonder if there's fall damage in this game. Really? So annoying. Okay. Okay. I need to run. I'll show you care. Uh, this guy looks like a mini boss. Is actually pretty good. The falling, I mean. Uh, 
That's it. You know what? Um, hmm. Why are my grenades not equipped? Like... Ow, shit, really? Am I supposed to jump over that, too? Oh! Uh... Okay, it got stuck. So, how am I supposed to change... Hmm. Uh, thanks, whoever is controlling that. But first, how do I... There we go. Okay. I need to use one of these again. can't afford any of these new things. Oh wait, no, I can get that. Yes, please, more sword skills are always appreciated. Pretty sure it's me, my dude. Oh, that didn't do shit. Uh, we don't need to see anymore. You're dead. Damn! He just jumped all the way down there. Curious. Interesting. Ow, did you just bitch slap me? They sure scream a lot when they die, don't they? Oh, shit. Hmm. Hi, you did not just see that. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay. Okay.
I did not intend to do that, but I will take it. Wait, why am I going... Can't I just run across the... No? Okay. That's really dumb. I don't know why we can't just run across the parking lot. Since he was over there, but okay. Hey, look, a vending machine. Uh, we should probably save this money for here. On a cloud server, okay, that makes sense. Nope, we cannot upgrade any further, at least not right now. Take this one. I want to see this girl again. You know what to do. Don't dishonor the fuck me. Honey, there's gonna be a lot of dishonoring going on tonight. Oh shit. Ow, oh, fuck. They pack a punch, damn. Ah, shit. This is... Damn. That's weird. Does it not work? It does work, it's just really hard to pull off. There we go. I just need to get used to the timing. Okay. That's a cool map. Now then, which hoodies upgrade? Hmm. Should I upgrade my health or should I upgrade attack power? Start with health. So I seem to lose health fairly fast. Can't you just let it go? No. Stop following me. Yeah, I have a bad feeling. 
find out soon. Oh, this is totally a trap. How did I get hit for me from this angle? Oh man. How much health do you have? Holy shit. Now, the latest scoop on Noctis City. A local faction has sparked riots after rejecting peace talks with the president. We are reporting live from the scene. Noctis again. <laughs> How many buildings is it this month already? <laughs> Must be Factio Pugni again. <sighs> Wonder who's the poor soul this time. <laughs> hey, gorgeous! Another cocktail! On the double! <laughs> well, that combat was fairly fun. should still be around. Stay sharp. just pick up that big ass buster sword yes yes it did oh my god oh shit Wait, are there talent points for this too? I guess not. Oh, there were, but I didn't get to purchase any of them because they weren't locked yet.
Ow, shit. Ow, oh, man. What the shit was that? Oh, that was wild. Exploding. And mysterious guys still managed to fuck off. Uh, I see. Place is about to collapse. We have to get out of here first. I see. I rushed over as soon as I heard. If it weren't for you, Anne would have been in real danger. <sighs> she always tries her hardest. Hasn't changed a bit after all these years. Should be easier on herself. <sighs> oh, Ray! Could you help us locate Ryan? Sure. I'll let you know when I have anything. Got an urgent matter to attend to first. Zombies don't went berserk in a town nearby. Zombies? Witnesses saw a man in black wearing a bird mask. Uh, I'd better go check it out. Bird mask? Bird mask? Yeah, you know, like a plague doctor mask. Oh, uh, okay, sure. Be careful, Ray. <laughs> also, have you been recovering? I'll come and visit once I get back. You know a nice little Italian restaurant that'll be perfect for our reunion. Okay, well, it's time. Gotta go. Stay safe, you two. Reach out if you need me. Okay. We can handle our own problems, just like before. <sighs> what happened? <gasps> You're awake! Yay! <sighs> Where's the rum? How did I end up back here? It was Ray. He saved you. That's so... that arrogant. Hey, you can't say that about a person who saved your life. I was so, so worried about you when you went splat! Oh. Darling, aren't you gonna do something to comfort me? Get off first. What are these two... what is their relationship? What the fuck? Get off. This is a lot closer than just, just friend, just being friends, you know. Uh, kiss. Yep, thought so. Hey. S stay away from me. Come on, come on, I lost Ryan.
finds Rom. Please, let's go get your health checked first. I'll help you find Orion. Oh, now they got a cool great sword, but for but right now we do need to end the game today's session. It's been really quiet in chat today. I wonder if anyone's also confused or surprised with the quality of the scheme so far. It's kind of half and half. Um, it feels like they got nailed on the aesthetic, and thankfully the combat itself is actually fairly fun. But everything else is hot garbage. It's like I'm reading a really bad cyberpunk 77 fanfiction. Nevertheless, that is Animutationum. I think the game is fun, at least enjoyable enough to continue playing. For the foreseeable future, or at least until we reach the end of the line. For now, we're going to go find someone to raid tonight. I'm going to grab dinner, and thank you once again for everyone for coming. Who is going to be our... Who is going to be our victim tonight? Quite a few people online today, actually. It's always good having a variety of people to choose from. The other world ends with you. When you can't decide who to choose from based off of follower numbers, it's time to go based off of what game they're playing. So we could bring you all over to someone that's playing at least something similar. In this case, there aren't that many, to be honest. I do see that Recoil over here is doing some art, unless he just went offline. Did... Nope, he's still there. That's always a good way to chill out. He's a 3D modeler, so I don't think I've ever seen him actually do digital 2D art before. Well, I would say this one is more How many people we got on still tonight? Or did you guys get bored of animation them? Let's go raid. No one stuck around, huh? Yes. Seventy dollar Master Chief action figures, right? Mm -hmm. No problem. Then. We will not have a raid tonight. Thank you for stopping by, everyone, and have a good night.